Good. So, uh, looking at rehab for lower back pain. So our non-specific lower back pain, um, where it's just localized to the back, N not glutes, not any radiating pain, just lower back pain. So in an earlier video, we did early mobilizations with some like things like knee hugs and child's pose and rotations and gentle movements. Now the second step we want to do is get you to do some isometrics and strengthening exercises. So isometrics where the muscle isn't lengthening or shortening, it's contracting, but not lengthening and shortening. We'll go through that. So let's go to the floor first. So we're going to do what's called a pelvic reset um, to get in your quads, hip flexors and hamstrings going. So we've done this in an earlier video. Um, so you're going to push in uh, so flexing the hip, pushing in towards the chest with that one and pushing away with the other one. And you're going to push five or more seconds. So if we aim for 10, we'll aim for five for the purpose of the video, but you can, I tend to do five to 10 seconds. So opposite movements, five, four, three, two, one. And then you change, and then you push again, five, four, three, two, one. So as I'm pushing down here, I get my hamstrings working, as I'm pushing my knee towards my chest, I'm getting quads, kind of hip flexors working. And you repeat that for about 50 seconds to a minute. And then you do adduction, get a ball or a um, pedal, and you squeeze together again, squeezing five to 10 seconds. And relax, again, squeeze. Five to seven seconds, relax, and then repeat that for about 50 seconds to a minute. You might hear a little clunk in your pelvis um, if it's if one side is more rotated than the other. And then some other isometrics to go through. So a plank, which is a great rehab exercise, a terrible ab exercise if you're just looking to strengthen because like the world record is like a and like 14 hours or something stupid. But it's good for rehab. So into this position, onto your toes. And you want to drive your elbows towards your feet, okay? So you're trying to isometrically contract and hold. And then side plank as well, again isometric, no lengthening or shortening. Um, then we can go into uh, to work the bum. And just coming up and holding, squeezing the bum. Keep your knees out slightly. And you're rotating your feet, screwing your feet into the mat to really squeeze that bum. And then we can also go to a wall and do things like a wall squat. And again, just sliding down the wall and holding and going as low, low as you can tolerate. And ideally doing these isometrics, some of the isometrics up to 45 seconds and studies have shown for uh, doing isometrics is better to do them for longer, but again, it's individual as pain allows. Cool, thanks.